sing with joy, the water shall break forth in the wilderness and streams in the desert, the burning sand shall become a pool in the thirsty ground, springs of waters, the horn of jackal shall become a swamp, the grass shall become reeds and rushes, and a highway shall be there, and it shall be called the holy way, the unclean shall not pass over it, and the pool says the Lord, O oh, heavy one who thirsts, come to the waters, and he who has, has no money, come by and eat. Come buy wine and milk without money and without price. Why do you spend your money for that is which, which is not bread, and your labor for that which does not satisfy? With joy you will draw water from the wells of <coughs> salvation, and you will say in that day, Give thanks to the Lord, call upon his name, make known his deeds among the nations, proclaim that his name is exalted. Sing praises to the Lord, for he has done gloriously. Let us a reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Mark. Glory to thee, O Lord. Glory to thee. Let us attend. In those days Jesus came from Nazareth of Galilee and was baptized by John in the Jordan. And when he came up out of the water, immediately he saw the heavens open and the Spirit descending upon him like a dove. And a voice came from heaven, Thou art my beloved Son, with thee I am well pleased. Glory to thee, O send down the blessing of Jordan and sanctify these waters. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. That this water may become a gift of sanctification and remission of sins unto the healing of soul and body and unto every expedient purpose. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. That this water may spring up unto life eternal. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Great art thou, O Lord, and marvelous are thy works, and no word suffices to him thy wonders. Great art thou, O Lord, and marvelous are thy works, and no word suffices to him thy wonders. Great art thou, O Lord, and marvelous are thy works, and no word suffices to him thy wonders. <coughs> All creation singeth praises unto thee, who didst reveal thyself. For thou, our God, didst appear on earth, and didst dwell among men. Thou didst sanctify the streams of Jordan, and that thou didst send down from heaven thine all Holy Spirit, and didst crush the heads of the serpents that looked there. Therefore, O King, who lovest man, do thyself be present even now through the descent of the Holy Spirit, and sanctify this water. Therefore, O King, who lovest man, do thou thyself be present even now through the descent of the Holy Spirit and sanctify this water. Therefore, O King, who lovest man, do thou thyself be present even now through the descent of thy Holy Spirit and sanctify this water. And give it the grace of redemption, the blessing of Jordan. Make it a fountain of incorruption, a gift of sanctification, a remission of sins a protection against disease, a destruction of demons, and accessible to hostile powers, filled with angelic Thou might. Art our God, who didst cleave the rock in the wilderness, so that water gushed forth and streams overflowed, and did satisfy thy thirsty people. Thou art our God, who by water and fire through Elijah didst bring Israel back from the air of Baal, 
do thou thyself, O Master, sanctify even now this water by the Holy Spirit. Do thou thyself, O Master, sanctify even now this water by thy Holy Spirit. Do thou thyself, O Master, sanctify even now this water by thy Holy Spirit. When thou, O Lord, was baptized in the Jordan, the worship of the Trinity was then Baptized in the Jordan, the worship of the 